Cross-contamination is when a biological, physical or chemical hazard is transferred from one product to another. For example, on food surfaces, hands, linen or equipment and passes to another place. Examples include a sick food handler, other contaminated food or dirty utensils. Cross-contamination from poor food handling practices is a major cause of food contamination and food poisoning incidents. Preventing cross-contamination is covered later in this course. Cross-contamination can occur from person to person. If you shake hands with someone who has not washed their hands after going to the toilet or who has sneezed into their hand. Person to food. If you don't wash your hands after going to the toilet, then touch the food. Food to food. If you allow raw meat to drip onto ready to eat food on a lower shelf in the fridge. Equipment to food. If you use tongs to take raw chicken to a pan, then use the same tongs to move cooked chicken to a plate. If you use a meat slicer to cut raw food, then use the same slicer to cut cooked food. Linen to food. If you handle raw meat, wipe your hands on a tea towel, then use the tea towel to wipe a bench where the food was prepared. Crockery to food. If you use crockery with chips or cracks, germs can grow in the chips and crack and then can get into food.